endorse the tax or discredit him in front of his followers by getting him to support the tax and thus the earthly king of Caesar. Theologians Charles Barclay and Edgar Krentz both interpret this passage as an instruction for Christians that the Christian ethic is not one of rebelliousness or rebelling against the law, but of recognizing our place within society and contribu becoming a contributing member to society. That interpretation could naturally provoke a conversation about the ethics of politics, about how there is a conflict of supporting a government that consistently treats people unfairly and unjustly, that restricts medical options for women, that restricts our options of who may, we may love and be with, that provides education that is substandard for the poorest and the the poorest and the most uneducated in our society so that they do not have opportunities to move ahead.